Tuscaloosa. Brown behind the wall of blockers up to the 30. To Tim the 30 with Thomas Brown in the backfield. Stafford flushed. Throws on the run and complete to the 47-yard line to Muhammad Massaqua. Got a chance to play. But his numbers are better this year. Here's the flanker screen. Bailey with a catch. First down and more. Bailey down to the 30-yard line. The clouds overhead. Brown again. Off the left side, not much there to the 27. Let's take a look at tonight's X Factor. Dumping underneath to Marino, and Marino. Well, it looked like a screen pass, but there was nobody there to block. They just let everybody through. He directions. I'm amazed they haven't taken a timeout on a critical down like this. It's another screen, and it's going to go for a touchdown with Brown. Well, you could tell they were confused. Guys were pointing at each other, saying, you go this right. way, no, you go that way, and the middle just opened up. And that was a beautifully deepening drive. Five minutes and 30 seconds off the clock, and the Bulldogs have taken a 7-0 lead at Alabama. Alabama from the 23. Grant is the tailback. Cuts it back, has a seam. Grant drives his way out to the 44. Nifty move. C.J. Bird had to make the tackle after a gain of 22. Good protection for John Parker Wilson. Now it starts to break down. See, that's Georgia. Georgia plays a lot more zone defense than what John Parker Wilson saw last week with Arkansas. Bulldogs at the 35-yard line. Stafford to the shotgun on third down. Blitz coming. Stafford throws in the flat. They've got the first down to Brown up to the 49-yard line. Stafford straight back. Good protection. Guns it down the middle. Complete to the 35-yard line. It's to stand here. Brown. Nice hole, power running to the 22-yard line. Up in the box. Good play fake by Stafford. Down the middle, wow. incomplete. Nearly yeah. intercepted. The Alabama defense adjusts. Draw play, Marino. Those were the kind of adjustments they were not making early yeah. when Stafford. Brandon Katu, who is a terrific field goal kicker, will try from 45. And it's good. He's hit six out of seven this year. That was the longest at 45 yards. It was. Straight up the middle, a power run by Glenn Coffey. Uh, okay. <laughs> In that case, he would have needed to be about seven feet tall, though. That's why these guys have 36 inch vertical <laughs> jumps. Okay. Thanks, Holly Stafford, facing a second and ten. Just want another pick. good run by Brown. Just want to pick the right kind of food to cook at a uh, football game, at a tailgate. Wilson throws this one away. And one more and put Notre Dame in there. I think uh, that Notre Dame, no matter what color. They're wearing, I think it's classic. McCoy makes the catch. He'll get out of bounds, especially. I mean, John Parker Wilson, excuse me. Blitz coming. Didn't have a chance, and that's going to be a face mask as they literally almost dehorned him. Jeff Owens came in. Well, and as soon as the helmet comes off, that's a dead ball. The ball is dead, and he got hit after his helmet was off. So I think there's two fouls on the play. Now. You definitely do not want to sack if you're John Parker Wilson. Deep down the middle and incomplete had Matt Cadell and missed it. So, Tiffin from 40 yards to cut it to a one touchdown game. And Tiffin is perfect. Under 
coach Gene Stallings. Watch the sneak here. There it is. Well, they made it look easy, too. Well, you know, I was watching some tape with Major Applewhite. And it looked like Georgia in their goal line defense gives you the sneak. They don't pinch that in. The linebackers play a little deep. And plus, your center, Antoine Caldwell, is one of the best He's in the, the SEC. Best. That's a good guy to go behind. Blitz coming. Throws underneath and it's dropped right in the bread basket for Trip Chandler. And that's his. Blitz, but a nice throw and yeah. catch. Bailey runs the quick slant. Stafford hit him in stride. And that's where. Marino straight power run. About a yard shy of a first down. Stafford play fake. Gonna run for it. And wow. just Good feet. got there. Rolando McClain, I thought he yeah. was gonna drive him out of bounds short of the first down, but Stafford again, he's a big quarterback. Stafford with a post to Bailey and Bailey. Inside the 20 to the 17 yard line. Simeon Castile finally wrestled him down, but it's a gain of 33. Fake to Marino. Slam, tipped, incomplete, but a flag. Castile with the coverage against Western Carolina. Pass interference. Defense number two. The ball will be placed at the spot of the foul. First down. Somebody, if you're not altering their body position. Marino on the toss. Touchdown. Wow. Bruce Figgins to tight end with a good block on the corner, and Marino took it in. Thanks, Reese. USC's pretty good, aren't they? Yes, they are. The biggest question about them is can they stay focused? You know that with a 10-point lead. Alabama has to score, get the ball back, score again. Wilson down the middle. Great, Great. catch, even with contact. Yes. Keith Brown hangs on. What a throw. What a catch. And the two safeties, Jones and Johnson, sandwiched it. Here those pads smack Alabama. Grant. I'll tell you the thing I like about Alabama. A lot of time, John Parker Wilson going deep. McCoy. Tipped away at the last minute. Jones. I don't know why. Coffee. Yeah, on 71. They were thinking with you. Yeah. That was a corner blitz off the short side. Actually lost a yard and a half, so it's third and two. John Parker Wilson falls down. It looked like his center stepped yeah. on his foot. Coming out, they lose a couple of more. In seven. Game could be on the line right here. John Parker Wilson throws it. Yeah. Can draw a flag, yeah. and it does. And, and it's the right call. D.J. Hall was the intended receiver. Prince Miller was covering him, and he was all over him. Safeties are cheating up. Wilson for the end zone. Hall out of bounds at the no, They said he didn't catch it. They said he was out of bounds. I don't know. I thought he had a foot in. Usually when it takes this long, uh, it is not so much about the call, it's where the spot might be. Yeah, good call. It would be, we're told from the replay, at the seven-yard line, first and goal. After review, the ruling on the field is reversed. Thought for all the world he was going to say the ruling is going to be upheld. It was the way he phrased it. Good snap, good hold, perfect kick. 20 to 13, Alabama within a touchdown. Behind Sutherland. You saw some confusion on that Alabama defense. Georgia wins first down. 
and some. To the 47 yard line. One call at seven. Brown hitting the backfield and drilled. Wallace Gilberry. Yep. Maybe out in the flat they've been so successful with those. Instead, Stafford downfield. Players got their feet yep. tangled up and they will not call that interference. And they Simeon should. Castile was right with Goodman. Timeout, 438 for Alabama right now. Second and 10, Wilson airs out another one. minute drive at the end of the half already tonight draw play to up church getting his first chance to play coffee runs into his own man second effort has the first down John Parker Wilson with time underneath McCoy. That could be a pick. That yep. could be an offensive interference call. I think, I think it, it could be that, but I think Andre Smith, the left tackle, was downfield. I think he was across the line of scrimmage when the ball was thrown. That wouldn't be good either. Yeah, that's Andy, what that you're is. Right. Up church is the running back. We'll get the ball in a draw. Up church inside the 10 to the 6. First and goal. First and goal. John Parker Wilson has to take off. Complete up to the 42. Ball came loose, but it was after the tackle. It'll stop if they get a first down until they move the chain. Wide receiver screen. Now the clock will stop until they reset the chains. They're across the 50. They need a first down to stop the clock. Brown on the draw. He won't get there. At now, the 42. Use a timeout right here. Yeah, Mark Rick's calling the timeout. Got to. Blitz coming. Stafford over the he middle. Cut it. Tight end got that one. <laughs> they got to get up and spike the ball. They got to get up and spike the ball. The clock will stop until that's the beauty of college. Now with five seconds, it won't start until they get the chain set. Plenty of time for Matthew Stafford to spike the ball and kill the clock and set up the field goal. Takes the snap, kills the clock. How about Trip Chandler? Whoa. Distance, but it's one. Do you believe this? Snap in time to take advantage of. It. Pressure coming on John Parker Wilson. Throws behind. It was a late shift for Georgia. Cadell. Third and ten. Only a three-man rush. John Parker Wilson throws. That was almost intercepted by Asher Allen. The team. Tiffin from 42. Got it. So that is the mark for Georgia. They need a field goal. Stafford wants it all. Got it. Touchdown. Mikey Henderson on the first play from scrimmage. What a beautiful throw by Stafford. You ask, Mike, is it better to go on defense first or offense? Defense. You know you need a field goal to keep playing. A touchdown wins it. You can be more aggressive in your play calling. Take a shot on the first down, knowing that Katu's probably going to make it right from where you are. What a play. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. For Todd Blackledge, Holly Rollins, Ty